Hey, how's everybody doing today? Back again with another unboxing video. Okay, today what I'm gonna do is a quick unboxing of some rudder pedals that I ordered from a company that goes by the name of MFG. I ordered them probably the middle of last week. After 20 some odd stopovers somewhere, they're here this week. So they gotta get pretty damn, damn quick. The name of the company is MFG, which is, uh, stands for Milan Flight Gear. But the owner of the company is a man that goes by the name of, I just say Mr. Milan, and his original business, well, I'm sure he probably still does it in Croatia, is he's a master furniture builder. That's what he owns as a furniture company. And I guess he's an avid flight, um, flight simmer and throughout his time i think long story short he never could really find any flight rudder pedals that he was completely happy with he wanted something worked for him specifically and would work for other people and he decided to share it with the world so we ended up we ended up with the mfg rudder pedals they're made of an all composite material which is laser cut to precision from what I've seen, I haven't unboxed this yet. And everything works on, it's frictionless. It top of the line barons. It comes also with a piston in the box. I'll have to get the name of that later. It might be, I'm hoping it's even in here. I haven't even checked, but it, it, there's also a piston that you can add on that. Um, it's a dampen, a damp, a damper piston, which dampens the way when you push, and it falls back into place. Or you pull your foot down, things don't fall. It, it takes it takes the pressure off of everything. So, long story short, is I want to check the quality of the unboxing of how things were packaged. Hopefully everything's in here, everything's good. The box seemed to come in good shape. Like I said, I tracked it, 20 some odd stops. A lot of handling. So what we're gonna do is what I always do. I'm going to zoom the camera in, readjust things. I'm gonna do the, well, I'm gonna do the unboxing right from here. And we're gonna take a look at these and then I'm gonna throw them together, which really isn't, from what I've seen, a big project. There's a couple nuts and bolts. You put the damper piston on and you connect them via USB to your computer. I've heard, I've heard people say you can use the program and a couple people say you really don't. You can adjust the rudder pedals from right within uh, if you're using, if you're running DCS or whatever type of game, you, you know, race game. I, they're more of a flight pedal. I wouldn't say that these would be good for like, you know, I guess that's Formula One or whatever. I've never played it, but anyways, onward, we're gonna get into opening this up and we're gonna see the quality of how he did his packaging. Okay, so let's see what we have here. And it looks like It looks like it opens from the ends. The box is taped all the way around, but it doesn't open the wide way. Okay, well, let's hope everything slides out with ease. Yes, I did auto body a lot, and he yeah, has a lot of problems. Okay, that can happen with that. So, okay, so it's not gonna slide right out. As I thought, white styrofoam. It's what I seen in the other videos anyways. Hopefully we can get this out. Oh, all right. Well, that was nice. Very good. Okay. Lay it down. Okay, this looks like the top. All right, so let's do this. We're just going to cut the tape. It's pretty much all box and tape holding it all together. Where's the piston? Oh, the piston's right here. Very good. Okay, I think. Nope. T 
tape all the way from Croatia. Uh-oh, that got stuck right to something. Wow, what a nice finish. This is what I'm saying. This, this is, this is no joke. This is quality. This went through, you know, checks to where, to a process where they, I mean, this could have been made, it could do the same thing with, with half of, with, with half of the amount of quality control put into it. You, it, you, it didn't need to be this perfectly, def, you know, refined. I mean, this is, phew. wow. Okay, nice pressure on those. All right, so the damper comes separate. You don't get it if you buy the flight pedals. You have to add the damper on. It's like $40, and if you're going to plan on getting the damper, don't buy the pedals and buy the damper later because the damper is specifically made for these. Now, they make a lot of dampers out there for other things that look like this, but it doesn't come with the attachments and the spaces to correctly put them on your flight pedals. So if you're going to order them, I'd say if you had to wait a week longer to order, I would and save the money because you're going to get charged from shipping overseas where there's a I guess they would call it a tariff or whatever, a VAT. Um, I've seen a couple of different words for it. And you don't want to have to pay that twice because it's like $60 alone. Okay, so quality. Outstanding. Outstanding. Oh my goodness, you don't feel anything. Okay, we're looking, we're looking at the quality. And let me bring in some nice close-up. Look at... Whatever machine he uses to make this, it's obviously made of a composite. It must be layered. Maybe it's all cut from separate pieces. I wish I'd really like to see the process that goes into how he makes this. But the quality, now this is where your, your barons, I forgot what they call this baron, but it's something less. Sorry for forgetting the name. Everything's separated. But your barons roll on the cam. That's what gives you the movement. Okay, see? Your movement back and forth. Now at the bottom, without this, you're gonna get a little what they would call, I think I think it's called a detent without the damper. So when it comes down, you're gonna get a dunk. But it's very smooth. With this on here, it takes that away. You don't get that ever. It's gone. Okay, had some coffee and I'm back. All right, basically it's a few bolts. I mean, the cam I'm not going to change. I, I, I don't see no need in changing this cam. If I don't like the way this one feels, this one looks like it's got, the number four looks like it might have more of a curvature to it, so. I'll just have to wait and see. Okay, there's four black bolts. And all I can really figure out is these are different than anything else in the package. So they must be... They're for the black foot pedals. Okay. So, my main concern is I was looking at this piece. And all I can figure is it doesn't... Not configure. All I can figure out... Figure out. All you figure out is it doesn't go with this. This must be for like an extra piece for the V2. So, you know, I'm going to stick it in here because there's just no way. There's no way. No way. No way. All right. These really long ones. Again. We'll have to see in a minute, I think. Okay, first thing we're gonna do is let's get the spring on here. I don't even know if the spring's technically needed for the rudder pedals once you have the, 
the hydraulic damper on, but I'm gonna put it on anyway, just for a little extra oh, oomph. Okay, so I imagine this will have to go through here first. Yes, sir, -y boob. Okay. All right, when you screw this in, word to the wise, the white goes to the outside. Yes, these are the gray ones I thought I was saying, oh, he sent me the black, no. These are the gray. The black is solid black on the top. So that's fine. These are the gray which I ordered. Tell you the truth, does it really matter? Okay, yes, and you also don't want the open part where the nut is sitting. You definitely want the pull to be to the inside. I just watched a video earlier where the gentleman turned it the other way and that didn't work out well for him. Okay. One more thing is it looks like the spring just sits right on here. So I imagine this material is durable enough to be able to hold it. Like I would have thought maybe a, a metal sleeve went over it, but no, that is what it is, is what it is. Okay, so this is gonna go on like this. This slides way under yonder and goes right through there. You can put it to the inside more on the outside. I'm gonna put it to the outside for now and you turn the nut until you get it, the tension off of it. I mean the slack out of it. Those weren't. Oh, nice. Okay, boom. These, obviously, these are the screws for this. Okay. I think, yeah, they have to be. Yep, they're the only ones that size, okay. So these two go on, I'm not gonna worry about socking them down right at the moment. So basically, yes, the rod just goes through the opening. You can see it right here. There's a little crown sticking up with a hole in it. It goes through the spring latches on. You put them together and it's pretty self-explanatory. I just want to get that down just a wee, a wee bit. Well, there's, there's a couple of good ones like Spud Knock. He's, he's, he's awesome. He's got a good sight. Grim Reaper, he's got a big sight, and he's, he's British. Okay, so we got that like that. The spring is on. Now, I'm going to put the foot pedals on last. The damper, you definitely want... There's an adjuster right there for your tension. Yeah. Okay, you want that towards you, obviously. You don't want to be crawling under the, under your desk freaking trying to get that fixed. So this goes here. And these go right on through. Okay, let's not forget the little rubber end cap. You don't want to stub your little toesy on that thing. Be whining like a baby. Okay. Um, so to the front is plus, to the back is less. Okay. Me and dropping these damn things all the time. Yeah, the the Allen key he he says that you, you gotta buy it on the site. But it seems that he threw it in, so thank you, Milan. So what do you have? Okay, the the it floats a little bit. Yeah, 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 yeah. Another thing which was pretty cool is these little hoses. Are uh, these little on the older ones? I seen a video. They didn't come attached. He puts little lockdowns and put some on for you so when you get it it's good to go again definitely a guy definitely takes care of his people these are pricey with shipping US dollars 
you're looking at 400 boogers close to 400 boogers yes that's dollars folks boogers before you decide whether or not you really like it get some cheapy stuff don't go out and like spend like mediocre money get mid-range stuff to find out you're just gonna run out and have to spend an arm and a leg on a bunch of expensive stuff I've been playing enough to know that I like it and I'm gonna invest one more time into some decent stuff I don't, yeah he didn't send every size um, Allen key which is which is fine I get it you know I get it I do I get it that's all right because these these hex if some places call them hex some call them Allen's so he sends the, the black ones the black screws and for the black pedals and these long ones right here if you're going to replace the cam and you need they give you two you can tell already it just it just by measuring it it just goes all the way right through to the bottom a little bit i don't know if you can adjust the tension on these this would be the brake and these these combat pedals are pretty much almost identical to what you're gonna find inside of a fighter. Wow, what a difference with that damper on. There's no, you, you feel nothing at the bottom. It's just smooth as, smooth as ice, slippery as ice, wow. Okay, so that's together. And the last part that you would have to do, what do we got here? It's about a meter. I don't even know what a meter is. Okay, it's probably drop it to the floor. Okay, I'm four foot eleven. <laughs> All right, I'm five six, and this is about six inches. Okay, it's about six feet. So you get about a six foot cable with it. Let me check one thing real quick. Let's turn that way over. Okay, that's. Oh yeah, that yeah. You can't even move it. Let me turn this back. Wow, that's different. I think I'd want them much looser than that. That's not bad. I don't know, I'd have to test it. Okay, it, it works. So this, this alone right here costs like about 40 bucks, which if you look at the quality of this, it's worth it every penny. But as I said, I'm not telling you what to do with your money. If you want to audit twice, go right ahead. But this is going to end up costing you around $100 with the shipping. So if you buy these, you're better off getting this with it. He has them on his site. He had everything in stock. He threw in a couple little extras. Thank you, sir. I, I know he's going to see this video. I'm very happy. So everybody, take care, have a great day. Peace out, brothers, and fly straight.